Here is a basic overview of a parachute. For this graphic demonstration, we're going to use a 7-cell parachute similar to the one we pack in the video. Here you can see the 7 individual cells. We will start here with the nose of the parachute. The nose faces in the same direction as the jumper. As the parachute rotates, you can see the stabilizer fabric attached at the base of the outer cells. As the parachute continues to rotate, we will finish up with the trailing edge, called the tail. For the purpose of seeing the lines better in this graphic, we will remove the stabilizers. Now, we can move on to the suspension lines. The lines highlighted white attach down at the front risers on the harness. Here you will see that these suspension lines cascade into two separate lines. The A lines, highlighted in green, attach closest to the nose of the parachute. Next are the B lines, highlighted in yellow. You will notice that the A lines are the shortest and the rest of the lines progressively get longer the further they get from the nose. The next group of suspension lines highlighted are going to be attached to the rear risers. You will notice that these lines also cascade into two separate lines, the C lines highlighted here in blue and the D lines highlighted here in orange. Finally, attached to the tail are the steering lines highlighted in red. Now, let's travel down the lines to the risers. Here you will see the slider. The steering lines pass through the slider grommets and then through the guide ring on the rear risers and terminate at the steering toggle. As we rotate here you can see that the suspension lines from the rear and front risers pass through the corresponding grommets in the slider. Now, let's take a look straight up the front riser and see how the lines attach at the link and where they attach at the parachute. When performing a complete line continuity check, this is what you'll be checking. As you can see here, it is very simple. The outermost line on the parachute should be the outermost line on the link. As the lines move inward towards the center cell, they should attach to the link in the same order. Now, let's look up the rear riser and you will see that the steering lines are clear of all other lines. And just like the lines that attach to the front risers, the lines that attach to the rear risers attach in the same order in which they attach to the parachute. 